Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons. Today is the day of the fishing tourney. Unfortunately, a few months ago I missed it, but this time around, not the case. We're gonna be going and doing a bunch of fishing today and seeing if we can't get first place in the tourney. I've never really done this before, so I don't really know how it works, but yeah, we'll just be sort of getting to our daily dues as well. So we'll be getting uh, fossils, fruit in the trees, all that kind of stuff. We also got a couple of letters here. First off, milk shopping with the leaf print wetsuit. That's cool. Uh, we also have the bamboo grass. And we have uh, Pashmina who sent a letter. Uh, things haven't been too rosy for me lately, but you don't seem, see me moping over it. That's because I'm thankful even for the bad times. You take all that stuff and use it for fertilizer, then see what blooms. That That's true, that's that's some good advice there. But also, we should probably check in Pashmina and see how she's doing. And I, I don't like that she's not doing too well, so hopefully we can help her out. And here's from mom. My dear zebra, the, the cicadas cry into, into the morning light, awakening the world with their C cacophonous symphony your mother cries out as well lamenting her lack of sleep <laughs> less sleep more snuggles mom oh all right so let's see what she sent us uh right over this way so first i've got the leaf print wetsuit that's cool to have bamboo grass which i think is music no it's not what, what is this again i don't remember buying this uh Oh, yeah, that's right. It was part of the, um, one of the events. Cool. And also, we got a present. This is Mom's plushie. Oh, that's so cute. Anyways, looks like we got a uh, Nook Miles done at some point. What is this about? Active Island Resident. Lively Island has lots of promise, hmm? To illustrate this, I'll reward you some Nook Miles based on the number of active days you spent here. Please take them and enjoy them. So we spent 50 days. Feels like it's been so many more than that, but okay. Cool. There we go. Uh, but there we go with that done. We are going to start checking some things out I'm very excited to see how this fishing tourney works and also I guess we should get some fruit along the way Just like that But yeah, we'll just try to earn up some money. We'll catch some fish. Have a good time today. It should be fun uh, It's it's really cool just to be able to check this out finally I missed the bug tourney as well, but there should be another one of those I think next month So we should be fine. So do we have to oh here we go. Hey there CJ Yo, what up, C Sports fan? I'm CJ, coming at you live. Hang on, of course I'm live, I'm right here. Anyway, I'm anchoring the premiere event of the summer e or C Sports season, the fishing tourney. So shine those hooks and get your reels ready, because between now and 6 p.m., the tourney is on. The rules of the fishing tourney are easy breezy. You just gotta catch as many fish as you can in three minutes. Every fish you catch nets you points, not enough points and you can swap, or net enough points, and you can swap them for some slick fish swag. Also, there's a cooler in the tent. Any fish you catch will automatically get stowed in there. Keeps the pockets dry. That means as long as you've got a fishing rod, you have all you need to compete. Simple, right? And you can enter as many times as you like. What do you say? Ready to get your feet wet in the fishing tourney? The entry fee is waived for the first turn, first run. Uh, what's the rules? Sure. The rules of the fishing tourney are easy breezy. You just gotta catch as many fish as you can in three minutes. Every fish you catch, next point. Okay, so he's just gonna say the same thing again. All right then, so yeah, we'll definitely be doing that. I don't know if I need a fresh fishing rod. I don't know if we can break during the tourney, so I would like to, for right now, say nah, I'm good. What, really? Way to be that the one that got away. Well, all right, the fishing tourney is on until 6 p.m. If the tide decides to turn you turn for you, cruise by whenever, I definitely will. But for right now, I just wanna to get to our daily things, get a new fishing rod, and then we'll get back into it and see how it goes. So yeah, that'll be cool. It looks like, yeah, there's other villagers around here fishing. I already see Apple over this way fishing up, and I see not one, but two fossil spots. It's been a couple of days, so there should be six of them around the town, so that'll be cool. Uh, hello. This looks way easier on TV. Oh, <laughs> poor Apple. And we got another one right here. Awesome. So yeah, fruit and fossils, those are the two main things I'm focused on for right now, but then afterwards, we'll get to fishing with a new fishing rod, and hopefully that all goes well. Uh, for three minutes, I think we could catch a good chunk of fish if we're really determined with it, and we don't even have to worry about our inventory. So yeah, that's cool. But for right now, uh, any other fossil spots over this way? Not looking like it, so yeah, I'm gonna grab this right here. I do see a couple of weeds around, so I definitely want to clean those up. You know what, I probably should also just get the axe out and work with that a little bit. So I haven't been doing that too much recently, so I'm just gonna put that, no, oh, here. Same thing with this. And got it. Yeah, it's, it's a pretty relaxing July weekend. 
Very glad I could, you know, finally get to this. Maybe if we have some extra time by the end of today's episode, I can also go and do some of the deep sea diving. I need to get back to that a little bit. Uh, but yeah, so far so good. Let's grab all of this. And then down this way. What else do we have going on? Lots of bugs. I'm gonna sort of worry about the bugs later if I can. If I don't have to worry about them now. That might be for the better. And there were some weeds right over this way. Make sure I get those too. There's just so much I gotta do in the game. Oh, present. Let's try to grab that with this. Oh no, I missed. Okay, hold on. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely not the best angle. There we go, much better. So what was that in the present? Vivid tights. Can't really see them over our current stuff, so I'll have to think about it, look at it later. Right now, it's a bit of a mystery that we're wearing it. Uh, but it looks like uh, we got both uh, Celia, oh, and Sally, and Kyle. I feel like you're staring at me, and it's making me nervous. <laughs> They're all gonna just fight over the same fish. You know what they say about fishing, right? Well, please tell me, because I can't catch anything. And then finally we got Sally. Um, I feel like you're staring at me, it's making me nervous. <laughs> They're so similar. Anyways, let's grab these weeds and we'll also check out our daily uh, Nook Mile since I haven't yet. You have some talking to villagers right there. Oh, and it looks like we do get some daily miles for doing the deep sea diving, the dive for sea creatures. We gotta catch bugs, I gotta tend flowers, sell fruit. Definitely gonna be doing some of that real soon uh, for right now though. Let's do this. And get as many fruit as we can for right now before we start moving on to other areas. Oh, here's another one. Yeah, there's still a lot to do in the game. I've been meaning to start picking it up a little bit more often. I've been pretty busy with a lot of different stuff, though. Um, I've been trying to play a lot of the original Paper Mario. I've been doing a series on that because the new Paper Mario game is coming out um, in just a couple of days. So, just been trying to keep on top of that. <laughs> so, I've been mostly focused on that recently. But there's, you know, been lots of cool stuff. I'm really curious to see what the next couple months sort of has in store for Nintendo in general. Because um, after Paper Mario, there's no new main Nintendo games confirmed at the moment. That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, put that back over there. There we go. But there's no more, you know, Nintendo games sort of confirmed at the moment, which is, it's been a while since that's been the case since, I mean, I guess it sort of was like that after the launch of Animal Crossing. We didn't know about Paper Mario for a little bit. So I'm expecting maybe like shortly after Paper Mario launches, maybe we'll get an announcement of a new game. So who knows? Uh, but either way, I'll definitely be happy with Paper Mario for a bit. I'm very excited for it. Uh, we had a lot of fun with Color Splash a couple years ago, too. Uh, but yeah, so far it's, it's been a fun year with all the different Nintendo games. There hasn't been a huge ton of them compared to some years, but I think that the things that have come out have been really fun. So, I mean, I think that's what matters most. Anyways, over this way, we got ourselves a, another fossil spot. So I definitely wanna grab it. Okay, um, and that is going to be three of them so far, yeah. Let's also grab some shells. I'm basically just trying to fill my inventory up with whatever I can. How is our money running? We have 8,000 bells. See, I did put some away at the end of the last episode. I don't rem didn't remember if I did that or not. Okay. But yeah, because of all of that and trying to keep up with different games, I haven't really been able to keep up with Animal Crossing too much the last couple of weeks. And I definitely want to change that um, just because there's still so much more I want to accomplish in this game. Oh, I definitely want to talk to Rolf as well, but let me poke around here. And here's uh, Lionel. No fossil spots up here, I guess not. All right, hey Lionel, buddy, how are you? You know what they say about fishing, right? Well, please tell me, because I can't catch anything. That's what uh, Kyle said. Gah, what? I wasn't sleeping, I was just visualizing a monster catch, precisely. So I think that we're, we're shooing to win the tourney because not too many people around here seem to be very good at fishing. Uh, hello. Come on, don't, don't wanna go home with nothing to show for my effort. Poor Roth. Keep that. I'm sure you can get something. He seems to be much better at ice fishing. All right, so let's get up this way. And here's fossil number four. So we've got two more left to find around here. I'm sure we'll find them sooner or later, but for right now, I am not seeing too much. Okay. So yeah, let me go back. I think on the left side of the island there was still plenty more stuff, so we'll definitely work on that for a bit. Gotta pull up the ladder just like that, and we're going down. 
Oh, there we go. Okay, I was gonna say, is there any more oranges down this way? Sounds like, and I hear some more of the cicadas, which I definitely probably need to catch for the one Daily Nook Miles to get five of them. But honestly, we've gone pretty quick at getting everything done. It usually takes me a good like 20 minutes to get all the island done. And there's still more of it, of course. We've got to still get the big fruit patch on the top left, but I feel like we're, we're much faster at it now. You know, I did think I, I might have passed up near Apple's house, so if I could vault back over there. Oh, yep, there definitely was. And any other fossil spots or anything? Not looking like it. Oh, wait, 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 wait hold on. Oh, yeah, okay, there's a couple of fruit, fruit trees. So maybe I'm not as good as I thought. <laughs> Whoops. That's okay. How's our inventory doing? It's actually, it should be fine for us to fill things up enough that we can get everything left on the island, I think. And eventually we'll have to look around for the money tree and stuff. We'll get to it. But yeah, beyond that, of course, I still need to work on more infrastructure for the village. I need to get the other two fruit types. Uh, we need to catch more efficient bugs. There's a lot to do in the game. I definitely, it's just, this is the kind of game where you're supposed to chip away to every day. I just haven't been able to do that too much. So I definitely want to change that up a little. Hopefully, maybe starting in today's episode. If not, I'm sure the next couple of episodes, or a couple of uh, days, I'll try to find more time. Uh, to start playing it daily, but it might take me some time to build up to it. Anyways, there are some oranges for us. And, got a money tree right here. So I don't know if this will actually grow properly if I plant it so close to another tree, but we're gonna find out. This will be a little experiment. Burying hole. There we go. And I think, oh, oh, okay. Wait, well, first off, Stu, hey buddy. Yeah, fishy, fishy, fishy. Come out of the water so I can taste you. I like his hat. <laughs> it's so small on his head. Uh, but there's fossil spot number five. I didn't realize it could show up like this. It's a little weird, but I like it. There we go. So, five fossils. Still plenty more to go. Well, not actually plenty more, but plenty more things to do uh, in terms of the island. That's sort of what I meant in my head. <laughs> but there's still only one more to find. I actually don't know where it is. Right? Or did we? No, th this is definitely just five of them. So it's gotta be around somewhere, but I guess I've missed it so far, so I'll look around for it at some point. But for right now, let's go ahead and knock down all of the different fruit trees. And this should all make us a good chunk of cash. So that's worth it, for sure. Probably around like 30 to 40,000 bells if we include the fossils, if there's any repeats, which there most likely is. So that'll be cool. Anyways, let's grab all of this. Alrighty then, so there's all of that picked up. I still don't see that final fossil spot, but we'll look around for it. Right now, I have enough fruit to sell and everything, so that should at least be good, and then probably poke around for more of it, but I probably need more inventory space anyway, so yeah, let's get to this. We'll also take this chance to buy an extra fishing rod, so that'll be good. Hey guys, anything new here? Oh, there's a little ship in a bottle, but beyond that, it looks like everything else we've seen before. What is this, is this a chalkboard? Wall-mounted TV, oh, okay, <laughs> it'll take a chalkboard. 20 inches, 8,900 bells, I'll take a pass on that. But, interesting to know. So, um, I want to sell for sure. And tomorrow's a turnip day, I don't know if I should, I should at least try to take a look at the prices for that. Um, for right now though, we got oranges, I got these flowers over this way. Bunch of oranges and pears and cherries and stuff. And some shells, should make us a decent little return. It looks like I did have enough uh, room for another Fossil, but 32,000 bells just from all that. That's really good. Gets us the 40,000 even, basically. Um, and we get some Nook Miles for selling the fruit, which is great. Okay, I also, while we're looking around for that one extra fossil, now we can knock over the, the trees. So I guess I'll do that, but then I'm gonna start catching some bugs with the net. Just sort of multitask with that a little bit. So yeah, not too bad, for sure. But that's another thing is I need to check out more villagers uh, as we, you know, explore other things. So, uh, using the amiibo cards. I still have plenty of them. You guys have been giving me some requests on different villagers to check out. I don't have every amiibo card, but I have like a good couple of them. So, if I see any requests for the ones that I have, I'll definitely check them out. It was a butterfly over here, but I don't know where they went. Weird. <laughs> okay. Oh, here's a little blue bottle going against the wall for some reason. So, there's already two of them. Oh, oh that, I, I don't know if I've gotten that bug. But here's one of the leaf ones. We've seen a couple of these, but not too many. There we go. Oh, I probably shouldn't have ran at you, I'm sorry. 
So no more running, I'm gonna scare away all the bugs I'm trying to catch. Still not seeing that fossil spot, but I missed some fruit here. Don't know how I did that. I think Biff is the only person we haven't seen today either. Is he home? He's the only one not fishing. What's up with that? <laughs> See, does he not like fishing very much? I guess not. Hey, Biff. Huh? Oh, no, we actually haven't talked to Pashmina. It's Iron Z. How are you doing? You have, we haven't caught up with lately, Squirt. I saw you around the other day. You had quite a spring in your step. Have you been skipping leg day? I have not. <laughs> All right, well. Biff is doing fine, but we should also check, while I have it on my mind, I should go and check on Pashmina. She sent us that message earlier today, saying she wasn't doing so well, so it's good to you know check in on everybody. If they're not having a, a good time, let's see if we can't help out with that. Oh, is she not home though? She's not. So maybe she's out fishing somewhere and I just haven't seen her, but if I do see her, I'll definitely say hello. Okay, well, in the meantime, Gotta look for a couple more bugs. There's another blue bottle. Hey, it's something. And. Do I see another blue bottle? They are everywhere today, aren't they? Wait, oh wait. Gotcha. <laughs> Trying to get away from me. And I think that's gonna be all of the bugs we need for the Nook Mile, so let's go ahead and get that. And now we gotta catch a surgeon fish. I'll try, we don't see too many of those. I don't think. Have we ever caught a surgeon fish? I can't remember. That's the wrong thing. There it is. But now we just got chopped down 10 wood. That should be not too bad to do. It's still so weird that they're all trying to fish at the same spot at once. That's not gonna help them too much. Well, they all have their own special fishing hat, which is just wonderful. Okay. Oh, that bug is new. I'm pretty sure. Got it. Oh, just barely too. What is this? I caught a jewel beetle. It's a rare gem or a real gem. Very cool. So there's a new bug for us as well that we'll definitely be donating. But in the meantime, I think that's enough for the Nook Miles. Yep, there it is. Okay. So we get 150 right there, no problem. And what's gonna take that place? Customize items. So I don't have to worry about that too much right now. I'm just looking for more fossils really or at least one more fossil, wherever it may be. Whoa. Okay, do I have this beetle? I don't remember. So I might as well grab it just to be sure. Oh, okay, I got it. I'm always so worried about those ones. I got a Mayama stag, so yeah, we have. I wish uh, Flick was still around. We could uh, sell them all to him and make some good money. Aha, there it is. It was sneaky, I probably ran past it a couple of times too. There we go. So that is going to be fossil number six. So we're going to run over to uh, Blathers and get some things figured out from there. That'll be good. But for right now, I need to switch over to my ladder. There we go. And I think over to the, the vaulting pole so we can get over even more easily. But yeah, that is definitely going to be six fossils and a bug for Blathers to check out. I don't know if all the fossils will be donatable, but wouldn't that be cool if they were? Anyways. Here we go. So yeah, we'll see what he says. I gotta imagine we're probably pretty close to getting all the fossils in the game donated. So hopefully only a couple more to go, who knows? So, uh, assess fossils first and foremost, just to uh, get that out of the way. There we go. All six of them. Ah, uh, all of them, darn. That really stinks. Oh, we couldn't just get like one more there. It shows you how close we are though. Uh, make a donation. We still have a, a jewel bug to donate here. Uh, jewel beetle. Here you go. He's not gonna be so happy about that, but I would still love to hear uh, his description on it. Uh, the green shimmer of the jewel beetle's wings is nothing short of nauseating, yes? No? Well, so says you. <laughs> Though jewel beetles were once prized by collectors who turned their iridescent wings into pretty jewelry. Why, anyone who would want to wear a bug part on their body is beyond me. Fashion foul indeed. Anywho, my sincerest thanks for your donation. Alrighty then, very cool. So, uh, there's that. That seems to be all we're donating today, because you have all these fossils, but 
Let's head out of here and we will just sell a bunch more stuff, make a little bit more money, and then buy the fishing rod, because I forgot to do that. But then we can go more forward with the fishing tourney. That'll be a lot of fun. Really looking forward to that. So right over here, just gonna go on in. And also, once again, I gotta check the turnip prices. Even if I don't plan on, obviously, selling any turnips, I don't have any turnips to sell, I think it would be cool to just sort of keep an eye on the price, 96 bells per turnip. So, unless they're like, like, 40 to 60 bells, maybe 70. I don't even think I'm gonna get them if they're any higher than that. Uh, but for right now, we have some things to sell. We have butterflies, fossils, bugs of all sorts. Oh, not the, not the, the wood. There we go. 24,100 bells, nice. So we jumped from 5,000 to 64,000, and I might be able to jump a little bit more if we find another money rock. I haven't been able to do that yet today, but uh, that'll probably be next on our to-do list. But first off, a replacement fishing rod just in case. Is there anything else here? Because we already have one wetsuit. This is a different kind than what we have, I think. Yeah, ours was blue. I don't know if it's worth it just to get different stripe colors. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, anything else? Not really. Okay, very cool. So we've made some good progress today. Let's look around for that money rock a little bit, and then I think we'll get started with the fishing tourney. Oh, I got a gold nugget out of this one. So I've been just looking around for it, but I'm glad to get a gold nugget. We haven't found one of those in a little while, but sooner or later, one of these will be the money rock. Here it is, it was actually the last rock that I checked, but we got to it, and that's fine. So, yeah, I feel like I've been doing this a lot, so I just figured I'd cut to whenever I found it. Uh, but there we go, that's gonna get us over 70,000, maybe even more, we'll have to see, but yeah, very nice for sure. Oh, there's 73, 77, very cool. So, oh, I don't think I've gotten that beetle. I gotta really stop running around. There's Pashmina, hey, you've been fishing? Perfect fishing weather, time to catch a few fishies, kidders, I agree. All right, very cool. So with all that out of the way, I think I'm good to just get started with the fishing tourney. <laughs> it's taken us this long, but it was definitely worth it to put all that time into. So let's talk to CJ again. Oh, what up, Fly Fisher? Wanna dip those toes into the fishing tourney? The entry fee is way for the first run. Sign me up. Aye, aye. All right, I'm gonna spray three minutes on the clock for you to catch as many fish as you can. Oh, and there's also a bonus that'll backstroke in if you catch at least three fish. You done nibbling on all that? Cause it's time to launch. Sir, um, so let's go ahead and switch to this. Fishing tourney, uh, ready, set, fish. So we have three minutes to catch them. I hope these guys don't mind. I'm gonna snag this one right in front of them. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, but can I get it is the question. Under all this pressure? No, 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 no talking. I, now is not the time for blabbing. That's why I talked to them all before. Oh, right away. Okay, come on, come on, fishy number one. In 22 seconds, uh, we got the pouch out. So if we keep up with that, we'll be able to get more in no time. Let's go to sprint down the river a little bit and see what else we can find. Oh, come on. Move the moment I threw that. But anyways, if we can keep at that rate of getting a fish every 22 seconds, we'll definitely be able to get enough for the three fish bonus. There we go. Come on. And that's gonna be another pale chub for us. We still have... Uh, a little bit le time left within this minute. So I'm just looking around to see what, what we got. Not much over here, the fish aren't showing up, that's not helpful. What do we got over here? Oh, big one. Uh, Not the best angling, oh come on, come on. <laughs> the angling, come on, there we go. That'll get him, right? No, is he gonna be picky with this one? Please, there we go, come on. Oh, right away again. And this is, oh, we got an all flounder. So there's our bonus. But we still have half of our time left over, so let's make the most of that. All of the fishing we've go, done in the game has come to this. So that's good. <laughs> I'm just gonna pick up a, a, a shell, I guess. Where are the fish at, though? That's sort of the thing, is that the fish just aren't showing up. Oh, here we go, probably another sea bass or something. Maybe a black bass. It's in the mouth. What are you talking about? There we go, right here. That got his attention. One more time, that's it. Whoa, what is this? I caught a Dorado, gotta keep this up. I don't think I've ever caught that before. That was big, cool. All right, well hopefully we get to keep the fish that we get here. Maybe I've caught a Dorado before, I don't remember. 
Either way, uh, we're going down here. We still have 45 seconds left over. There's gotta be more fish around. Maybe, could we use fishing bait? Is that cheating? I feel like he didn't mention it. Come on, come on. That's it. And that's gonna be fish number five. Tilapia. Can we get one more before the, this is all over? I sure hope so. I'm not seeing any more fish though. It's a problem. Uh, let's get up here real quick. Uh, run out of time, run out of time. 10 seconds left, can we find another fish? I don't think we can. So I feel like we could have done way better if we simply just could have had more fish showing up. All right, well, reel it in. The fishing tourney is now over. But I think we can do it more than once, right? I, I sure hope so. Picking up these weeds while I see them. Oh, did I get, what did I get Nook Miles for? Fishing tourney. Please participate in the fishing tourney, which is held every spring, summer, fall, and winter. I'll give you Nook Miles as a reward the first time you participate in each season. So we never did the spring one, but hey, we did the summer one, so that's pretty cool. Uh, we'll definitely, we'll do the, we'll do the spring one next year if we have to. I definitely want to get to it. But for right now, climbing down this way because I want to get back over to the town center. That was a lot of fun though, for sure. Very intense. I really hope I can catch that or keep that fish that I caught, the Dorado. Because I really don't know if we've had that one before. Hey, buddy. Hey, hey, there's my favorite angler. So how was it? Have fun? The fish you caught are all partying in the cooler. You can fetch them later. Or if you don't want them, I'll buy them. I need fresh fish for my live stream to keep my followers flowing. But the first things first, let's check out what you caught in the tourney. Looks like you stowed five fish in the, in the cooler. Oh, with a solo bonus waiting in at three or more fish. Splash, that's seven points. I am so hyped. Pour that into your points pool. If you've got enough points in your pool, you can swap, uh, swap them for a slick fish swag. How do I do that? Yo, yo, had a look in your cooler lately. If you've got fish in there to sell, I wanna buy. Um, let me check. No problem. By the way, I can't shoot the next tourney until the core is empty. Rules, rules. Okay, so first things first, let's go ahead and get our uh, fish. I would love to sell some to him, but I definitely need to see, this picture of the Dorado here is making it seem a little bit more familiar. So what I can do is I can check out the Critterpedia, and in the fish section, here's the Dorado. Have we donated it? Yes, we have. So we can sell all this to him, excellent. It's a very rare find, it seems. Yo, Fly Fisher, I'm packed with the, to the gills with the with fishing tourney knowledge. Ask me almost anything. Uh, there's something else. Uh, something else like, oh, have I told you about my live stream uh, needing fresh fish to gush over? And if you've got fish to sell, I wanna pay too much for them. You get paid, my followers keep flowing, win-win. Um, swap, well, let's first off sell some fish. Fantastic, what are you selling? I am selling whatever I can. There we go. Spilling a whole school, huh? That'll be 25,500 bells, what a haul. That's great. So that's gonna get us over 100,000 bells today. We started with 5,000, so that's pretty good. Splash, now you're swimming in bells. Paddle back uh, if you catch anything else to sell, which I will, uh, for right now though. Yo, Fly Fisher, I'm Pat that goes with fishing tourney knowledge, yep, yep, yep. Uh, there was something else. So, swap my points for swag. Hmm, you got seven points in your pool, so, sorry, but no, if you ain't get the, the at least 10 points and you're not getting fish swag, you gotta earn it. All right then, so let's definitely at least earn up 10 points, son. So, I wanna compete. How much is it gonna be now? Yes, nobody can resist the siren song, the fishing tourney. Uh, one thing, since you already sailed uh, the tourney seas today, I gotta have 500 bells um, for your entry fee, cool? That's fine, because we paid, I mean, we earned 25,000 from the last one. Uh, no, you'd be on board, that'll be 500 bells. I think most of that had to be from the Dorado. All right, I'm gonna spray three minutes on the clock for you to catch as many fish as you can. Oh, and there's also a bonus that, that yeah, yeah. Okay, so we know about all that. So we're going to try to, I don't think it, oh no, does it just start when I run away? Hmm. I didn't know if it started then or when I pulled out my fishing rod, but, I'm just going to be desperately looking for fish. I really do think we should look into maybe making some fish bait. 
maybe that'll work. I hope it won't disqualify us, but I feel like if it did, he would have mentioned that. Because that's the toughest thing so far, it isn't catching the fish, it's actually finding the things. I have not seen a single one so far. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Ready? Catch, thank you. Okay, fish number one coming in, but it took me more than 30 seconds to find a squid. That's not good. Let's keep it moving. I don't think we're gonna find too many fish up there. We usually don't. No fish in the river, or in the, in the pond. But there's this guy right here. We can get his attention, no problem. And he goes right away for it. So two fish in one minute. There we go, there's that black bass we keep mentioning. Okay. I, oh, I was gonna say, I don't see anything, but here we go. Oh, does he see, he's going in for it. Here we go. Another catch, halfway through the timer now. So if we could get up to six, it'd be great, but we'll have to wait and see, but for right now we got a tilapia again. Same place we got a tilapia last time. I'm not seeing too much, but there is one fish right there. Uh, hold on, hold on. There we go, what a cast. I can imagine CJ commentating the turning. That'd be pretty cool. And there is, oh, we got a rainbow fish. Gotta keep this up. I don't remember if we've gotten a rainbow fish before, so that's pretty cool indeed. Uh, let's go ahead, jump across, because we're go keeping good time here. So if we could just keep at it. I am not seeing too much in terms of fish here. That's a big problem. Okay, didn't really mean to do that, but where are the fish at? <laughs> Message in a bottle, not a fish. Here we go, here we go. Come on, that's it, that's it. Okay, so what do we get for this one then? Boom, it's a red snapper that gives us up to five. If I could catch six fish, that'd be great, but if I could catch more than that, even better, right? Because we got six last time too. Okay, here's fish number six. Oh, it's gonna take him a second to actually get over to that, though. Come on, you can do it. Ah, oh, this is gonna eat up the rest of my time. One more, one more, there we go, there we go. So at least we're gonna get six fish here. Actually, so that should be a better score. We only got five last time, Never mind. So there we go. And it looks like that'll be it for this one. Reeled in, the fishing tourney is over. So we gotta run back now. A little unfortunate with that, but. Oh, yeah, we have those bugs. I was gonna say, do I have that? Yes, I do. Uh, so right over this way. Let's see what he has to say about all that. First, let's get all the fish out of here. Uh, squid. Once again, I need to check out this rainbow fish. I'm pretty sure we have that one donated, but I can check real quick just by going into the Critterpedia. Right over here. Rainbow fish, there's a lot of fish. But he's, yeah, we, we did donate it. Okay, we're good then. Hey, buddy. Uh, the fish you caught are all party in the cooler. You can fetch them later, or if you don't want them, I'll buy them. We already got them, don't worry. Uh, so we should have gotten eight points, I think. Yep, eight points. I'm so hyped. Pour that into your points pool. Uh, so, we should have over 10 points now, so we should be able to get something out of that too. Yeah, a couple things to figure out. First off, uh, swap my points for swag. Hmm, you've got 15 points in your pool, so you got it, chum. What do we got? There's a keeper, your very own tackle bag. The fishing tourney goes on till 6 p.m. There's plenty of fish in the sea and rivers and ponds too, so get casting. Okay, uh, yo, fly fisher. Let's go ahead and sell our fish that we have right now. And hopefully we can make another 20,000. This seems like a nice time to make some easy fish money, you know? So there's six more fish. How many bells is that gonna give us? 12,000. Yeah, the Dorado definitely inflated the price a bit there, but still 12,000 is still great. And that gets us up to 114,000 in total. 115 actually, nice. Uh, splash, now you're swimming in bells. Paddle back if you catch anything else. You wanna sell. <laughs> Anyways. So we'll do this one more time today, I think would be good. Uh, we're just gonna compete again, 
hope that we can find some more fish this time. I know we could get some uh, fish bait, but that might, you know, take me more time than I'm willing to put into it right now. But yeah, the, the fish journey is a lot of fun for sure. Anyways, we're just going to quickly, oh, we already have the, no, I already had the fishing rod out. I'm being so silly. Oh my gosh, why? <laughs> why I have to be so clumsy? There we go. Uh, so let's quickly just run down this way and we'll just do a full circle looking for fish. Aha, here's one. Go for him. That's it. And that's going to be another squid. The squid's always on my back. That's good. Another one right here. Good to have two so close to each other. Oh, I thought it was gonna be in the third one. Okay, that's my first uh, major mistake when it comes to that kind of thing here in the tourney. That stinks so. I definitely think I'll go for one more after this then, at the least, but first minute's sort of floating by here. Sorry, Pashmina, but this one's all mine. Okay, this one's right away. I can get, whoa, what is this? I caught a sweet fish, gotta keep this up. Huh. Okay, I've not seen a sweet fish before. That is 100% a new fish. So that's cool. Definitely gonna have to donate that one. Hey, little fishy. Be yeah, a definitely th three points seems fine enough here. Oh, it's so cute. Caught a neon tetra. Pretty sure I've gotten one of those before as well, but who knows. Okay, here we go. It should see that. Yep. Come on. There we go. So this looks like it's gonna be my fourth fish. It's another sweet fish. I wonder what his actual description is gonna be then because it's the only thing I gotta keep this up because that's what it says during the tourney. So it looks like I have my fifth fish right here. This could have been a new record. I mean, depending on how things line up here in a moment. That's it. Might have enough time for one more fish. Oh, run, run, run. But I think this little circle that I'm going in might be the most beneficial. I say that, but there's, okay, here's one fish. Can I get it in time? That's right on top of it, so maybe not. Oh, come on, stop moving forward, what are you doing? <laughs> Oh boy, I could just, it's so close to me right now, I could just jump in and get it. Oh my gosh, this guy is just ruining it on me. Okay, come on, come on. There, come on, catch it, catch it, catch it, can we get it? Yes, we can, it's a even turkey fish to finish it. How fitting. So that could have been seven fish if I didn't mess up the first one. Sort of a shame, but I think that that's, maybe that's the little uh, pathway we'll start taking. Uh, I do wanna catch the cicada. Okay, ready, set. Catch, yeah, I got it. I don't think it's a new one, but brown cicada. Let's also take a look at our Critterpedia where it says, do I got a new fish? I do, right here, the sweet fish. Uh, very cool. So I'm glad that we got that. That's only available in July, August, and September. So I definitely need to donate one of those. So I'm gonna go and grab those out of the cooler for right now. Uh, I wish it was just a take all button that make everything much more useful. But let's just go right now, actually, yeah, yeah, let's go right now and donate that one sweet fish to uh, Blathers before I forget and accidentally sell it. And then we can go for one more fishing tourney. That should be a lot of fun. Uh, this time I'll just go through that one cycle and hope that I can break the score and get the seven points. That would be cool. I think we could for sure. So, make a donation. I'm donating a sweet fish. Reminds me of the candy, the Swedish fish. Uh, sweet fish. Now might I introduce you in some facts? Yes. Wonderful. Sweet fish are the damp heralds of the summer. These slippery fellows uh, appear in numbers when it warms up. They hatch in a river, then swim to the ocean. Once mature, they return to the river where they were born. But when they return, depends on when they return depends on the river temperature. If it's too cold, their fishing season will start later. Some even say summer can't start without a sweet fish, despite the key role played by the Earth's axial tilt. <laughs> All right, <laughs> I think he's taking it a little too literally there. 
Anyways, there we go. Uh, so I'm fine, thank you for that. Also, the rest of them to uh, CJ and get back to another tournament. But yeah, things are going good then. I'm happy with that for sure. And I don't know if that's gonna get us back over 10 points or not, but maybe we can exchange some more for some stuff. Oh, sorry. No, I just wanna talk to the guy. <laughs> Is that too much to ask? Hello. So. Yep, 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 he's gonna say all the th normal things he does. It's a six fish, eight points, so hyped. And, because we had at least two points before, so we're definitely over 10 right now. So hopefully it's just like every 10 points we get something new. Uh, there's something else. First, I would like to swap my points for swag. 13 points, you got it, chum. What is it gonna be this time? There's a keeper, your very own fishing rod stand. Nice. The fishing tourney goes till 6 p.m. There's plenty of fish in the sea. And rivers and ponds too, so, so get casting. Okay, one more time. We are just going to ask him for some some exchange bells for fish. But I'm really surprised with the amount of cash we made today. Really worthwhile. So five fish right there. Hopefully another 10,000-ish. Oh, not quite. So these fish definitely weren't as pricey, but even then, happy with the turnout. We definitely still need to go to the town center and we have to go to uh, Mabel's, just to, or the Abel sisters, just so that we can see if there's anything more. Uh, but yeah, let's just go for one more tourney first. So I wanna compete, 500 bell admission fee, shouldn't be too big of a deal. And this time I have the fishing rod out and ready. I am just going to sprint to the ocean. Okay, I am getting a very good head start this time. See, no, we know what we're doing this time. I'm going to get seven fish. Maybe. Depends on if any actually show up in the ocean. There we go. Oh, okay, fish number one. Coming in at about 15 seconds. It's gonna be a bard knife shawl. Over, no, what are you doing, what are you doing? Every second counts. I wish I could get that right now, but this is far more important to me. Whoop. There we go. Right away again. This one is gonna be, ooh, a tilapia. Fish number two, can we catch three in one minute? Right now the odds aren't looking high for that, but definitely not impossible. Going over like this. Probably shouldn't have actually gone to this side in the river though. I'm worried that I'm gonna have to use the vaulting pole soon. Come on. That's it, no, but my reactions were too slow. Come on. Oh darn. Come on, you can get it, you can get it. Ah, I don't know why, I'm just getting, I'm too, too, just like on the trigger with it. I'm just, oh gosh. Yeah, this is actually a big fl flop. This is a big flounder right now, huge disappointment. That's okay, we can still at least get three points here. As long as I make 500 fouls, I'll make my money back. So, you know, that's sort of the most important thing. Well, I was trying so hard to make the most of the time, I just started making more mistakes. You gotta keep a cool head with that. Okay, that fish was very quick. And that's going to be another uh, rainbow fish. So yes, I do need to jump across right now. There we go. So definitely, I think I could do this again and better. So I really might, because I, I really want to get one where we get like 10 plus, or not 10, because that would have to be eight fish. I, I feel like it's, it's certainly possible though. There we go, come on, come on. And that is a bluegill. Cause I missed out on like what, three fish? It was a lot. So actually I definitely could get up to eight points, I think. Well, we'll see what this is. Another tilapia. And I could catch at least one more fish in this time. So really not that bad of a score considering my multiple blunders. What, was there a fish there? There is. Okay, come on, our last one. Let's get to it. That's it. So yeah, even though we made quite a few mistakes, we still got six fish within this tourney, which shows you we could do even more. That's not what I meant to do. <laughs> so I think we'll go for one more tourney. I'm just gonna start heading back already. I'm gonna just save some time that way. <laughs> 
But certainly it's been a lot of fun. So yeah, six, six fish is still great. I'll sell those to CJ and we'll get back to another tourney. Okay, so we're back on another tourney here. This will be the last one of the day for sure, no matter what happens. So let's catch some fish and hope it works out well. Come on, you can see that, you can see that, right? Nope. Uh, I don't know why they've been so close to the shoreline today. There we go. Right away too, going right for it. This is gonna be another huge olive flounder. Keep running. Here's another fish. Right in front of him, right here. Perfect. Okay, fish number two, no problem. Two within a minute is not too bad, but we can do even better. We still have a little bit more left of this first minute. So making the most of it. Go over here. More fish than normal are popping up too, so that works. So I gotta make sure I get every one of them. Oh, that's it. Wow, I almost let that one go. That's a red snapper, very cool. So three so far. Okay, not too many fish around here, but I will go on this side again because my house sort of does get in the way with the specific spot it's in. Hmm. Oh, here we go, here we go. Gotcha. Maybe. Okay. And there is a black bass, four fish in a little bit past halfway. It just really depends on when and where the fish pop up now. But we're well on our way to making our best score yet. There are no fish here, which is definitely a bit of a problem, but if we jump across now, we can pull up our fishing rod again. That's a bug, not a fish. Doesn't count, unfortunately. Huh. I'm not seeing too much, and this is where it does fall on to luck. If there's no fish around, then out of luck. <laughs> what do you know? Oh, uh, looks like I finally missed that one present. There are no fish here at all, here we go. So at least we can get the score to five. So the only time I'm not messing up the catches is the time it's not giving me any fish. So I gotta find a balance there. I'm sure we'll figure it out eventually, but we can at least catch fish number five here, maybe. Hold on. There we go. Oh, and right away, which is good. That means there's more time for other things. It's always the squids too. Fantastic. Any other fish up this way? Not that I see. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, 10 seconds left to get you, not even. Ah, oh, you're not gonna be able to see that in time. Come on. Can it go in like overtime while I'm catching this fish? Ah, okay, I still got it, but it doesn't, <laughs> it doesn't count, does it? Well, there's a red snapper. Okay, so five points is actually one of my worst scores simply because the fish just weren't showing up for the second half of it. So we'll, we'll be back at it eventually. I'm sure there'll be another fishing tourney in the fall. So definitely will be a lot of fun when we do that. But for right now, I want to go back to CJ. We'll sell some uh, fish. And then we'll also see what else we can exchange our points for. Okay, so I'm selling the five fish in there. Uh, 14,000, that's actually a pretty good price right there. So I'm pretty happy with that. We got up to 145,000 bells. So definitely it's worth the 500 bell emission fee for all this. So super duper happy about that, making some major money today. And also we are going to uh, exchange to see what else we can get for our points. I don't know how many points I have at the moment. 18, so I should be able to get at least one more thing here. That's really cool. This is, there's a keeper, your very own anchor statue. <laughs> so there we go. Maybe I can make another episode a little bit later today where I just do more fishing. I don't know if you guys would be interested in that. <laughs> we'll have to wait and see. But for right now, uh, was that everything there? Okay, yeah, so actually I'm walking off. I'm not quite done. I still need to uh, go into the city hall, get some things done there. Also check out the uh, Abel sister shop and then we can just sort of see what our other things are going on, so yeah, for sure. Either way, 50 bonus miles, nothing too crazy there. All I'm looking for for right now is I don't think they'll shell, they don't sell the uh, yeah, the outfits here, the uh, swimming outfits. They sell those at the Nook Shopping. Because we have so many bells at the moment, special goods. Uh, do we have this version 
the Nintendo Switch? I can't remember. I don't think it's too important. Oh, I like this. Well, actually, no, that's what we already have, the leaf print wetsuit, okay. KK Country, I like that. Cool. So I just purchased it, um, and nothing new there. Okay, actually, pretty simple. I don't think we'll need more than, like, say, 10,000 bells uh, for Mabel. So I think that we can deposit a good 132,000. There we go, getting ourselves to 227,000. We still have a little more than like 900,000 to go there. But we're making some good progress. If we could, you know, do that every day, if we could make this much money every day, we'd be there in a little less than two weeks. So that would be cool. Either way, we definitely got some more Nook Miles Plus done there. So let's check that out. Right over here. here. So yeah, there's uh, 400 extra miles for us. Very, very nice. And yeah, let's go over to the Able Sister shop and see what extra stuff we can get in here. Hopefully some 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 good clothing. I don't know. You never know until you check. Hello. Uh, hey there, welcome to the Able Sisters. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, I see that jacket. I, I've gotten that, that starry jacket in the past though, so don't think we need it now. Oh, but we got a camo style bomber jacket in several different colors, the front side button down shirt, kid kids smock, uh, oversized shawl sweatshirt. Yeah, we've seen the space parka, long pleated skirt. We've seen a lot of these. Oh, this is new, striped pants, not too bad. Is there anything new here? I think that, yeah, the kimono is new. Okay, long denim cardigan, straw butter we've seen. The tiara is new, the imp hood is not new, but still very fancy. Glasses, leggings, all sorts of different stuff, but none of it down here seems to be new. Okay, take a pass on all of that then. Very cool that we were able to check it all out. Nope, sorry. <laughs> so yeah, let me just quickly put down some extra of the stuff, all the different fishing stuff we have. I don't know if any of it we'll use for decoration, but I don't know until we check it out. So the first thing that we got was the well, here's the anchor statue. Oh, fancy. That'd be fun by the beach. And then we also got this tackle bag. Not too bad looking, actually. I like that, we'll, we'll keep that for now. And then finally, the fishing rod stand. Oh, that's pretty cool too. You know, I think that would be fun to set those up by the beach somewhere. I think I have to set up like a proper pathing for it to make it look good. But yeah, that was still a lot of fun. Um, the fishing tourney was just as cool as I was hoping it'd be. Maybe we'll do another episode after this, doing more, I'll have to wait and see. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Animal Crossing New Horizons. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.